We're in Microsoft Windows 8 and Windows Server 8. I'm going to give you an overview of the tabbed browsing options in Internet Explorer. So we want to open up Control Panel, all Control Panel items, and then click on Internet Options. From here we go to the Tabs and Settings button. And now we have a list of all different kinds of things we can set. First we'll want to enable the tabbed browsing feature so we can open up multiple websites within one session of Internet Explorer. From here we've got a lot of different options. First one is warn me when closing multiple tabs. So if you click the X in the upper right hand corner of Internet Explorer it will warn you saying do you want to close everything or just the, the current tab. You also have the option of always switch to new tabs when they are created. So if you click on a link it will automatically jump to that new tab or you can stay on the original one by leaving that box unchecked. Next thing is to show previews for individual tabs and taskbar. That's when you go down into the taskbar and you will see various different web pages inside the taskbar list. If you want to see that you can have that box checked. Enable quick tabs. Uh, that's if you hit a control Q, it will automatically open a brand new tab in your same Internet Explorer. Enable tab groups. That allows you to group tabs by color uh, that link off the original uh, website that you're on. So if you're on a web, web page and you click a link, it'll open up a new tab, and inside that new tab, it'll the uh, the same color at the top as the tab that you clicked from. So you that way you can group them together in like tabs. You can also just have the box checked that says open each new tab next to the current tab. That's kind of handy so it doesn't jump all the way to the right. You can check the box that says open only the first home page when Internet Explorer starts uh, and, or you can hit the drop down and choose these other options as well. The new tab page or your first home page. When a pop-up is encountered you can set that to let Internet Explorer decide how pop-ups should open so it uses its own heuristics to do that or you can say always allow the pop-ups never a good idea or always open pop-ups in a new tab so uh, you can choose to leave the pop-up blocker on or you can make those changes there from here you can open links from other page other programs in either a new window a new tab which is the most efficient way or the current tab or window so it will replace the web page that you're on and if you want to set everything back to defaults you can click on restore defaults and it'll choose the default uh, settings that come with Windows 8